friends so welcome again and this is my new project online nursery store and i have developed this project in java spring boot react and masco so for spring boot version i am using spring boot version 2.1.6 release and spring and we have used hts spring boot tool suits for writing the spring boot application for react js we have used the visual studio code for writing for developing the react application and the for mysql we are using the jam server for using the mysql uh interface for performing a type of operation in the database right for ports we are using port 8080 for running the spring boot application and port 3000 for running the react js application right so these all uh, technology stacks and things we are using for developing this project online nursery store so let's start with the features and functionalities and modules of this project that what are the features available what are the modules available right so this is a mini project which has only and only customer panel there is no admin panel inside this project right but if you need the admin panel then you can comment on the video we will try to develop or integrate the admin panel on this project right so once you run this project you will get this home page you can see this is the home page and there are some categories are coming on the home page these categories are coming through the api spring boot api right and and if you click on any category then you will be able to see all of the product which belongs to that category right so this is the home page right and we are running using 3000 on it this is a category the same category you will get here and you can search the category from here like i am i don't i want to search the flower then you can see the flower is coming here and if you click on the reset then all things will be resetted this is the all products all of the products which is available in the database will be available will be displayed here there are nine products we have added right but if you want to add more you can add directly from the php my admin right so these all products we have uh, inside the database and all products are coming through the api right this is a registration if you don't have user id and password then you can register from here this is a login from here you can log in and you can perform short end operations it means you can see the order you can order the product and this is a feedback form and you can submit the feedback here right now i am going to log in so user id is amit at the rate gmail.com and the password is test right if you log inside the system you will get this dashboard you can see this is a customer dashboard here you the home page i already explained you the all products i already explained you this is a my cart currently there is no item inside the cart so it's showing empty right here the my orders you will be able to see all of the orders which you placed earlier if you want to see the details of any order just click on that uh, arrow icon you will be able to see the whole details meant when you uh, ordered it what is the total amount what are the product you bought these all order items is displaying here this is a feedback form again i have already explained this is a my account section from here you will be able to update your account details right now i am going to order some of the product some of the uh, plants right so all products and this is a add to cart right you will be able to see the details and this one for add to cart so i have added this plants and four items that is a ten thousand per cost and that is a four items and fourteen thousand right continue shopping right and if you click on this like uh, i want to see right this one at like this one right two items i have added right now i want to add this one also add to cart right one item so there are three items i have added in it to the cart now i want to delete this one just i delete it's asking for deleting the cart right so it's deleted and message displaying here now once you click on the checkout then it will show you the payment page here you need to enter the card details so this is a dummy page no need of entering any credit card details you can enter whatever you want right you can select a card type here and the year month and the submit right so you can see this order number 393 has been generated and this whole details will be saved inside your order history right you can go in the my orders and you will be able to see 393 here and once you click on this arrow icon you will be able to see the details of your order right 
the last one is a logout if you click on the logout then all of the session will be destroyed and you will not be able to access internal pages again let me show you so you can see this is the different menu now the my administration is not showing because it's a session driven menu it's coming according to the session now i am logging again right and then test submit i think there is some issue yeah there are two advocate symbol submit right you can see it's different menu right logout it's different menu so these all features we have developed inside this project and the project title is online nursery store and as i told you earlier this is a mini project developed in spring boot react and mysql if you need extra feature if you need more features in this page just put it into the comments we will try to incorporate those things we will make this project more better and better according to requirements and don't forget to subscribe our channel for getting the latest project videos and the latest technologies thanks for watching the video thank you very much